Hello everyone and welcome back to Miss Crafts Let's Layer. I am Barbie. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator based in the United States. And I am here to show you Paper Pumpkin and why I love it so much. Now, before I open this box, I have gotten Paper Pumpkin. As you, if you watch my videos, you'll know I get Paper Pumpkin every month. I am saying I have had Paper Pumpkin before and continue to get it. I have gotten my clear block already. If you are subscribing to Paper Pumpkin for the first time, your first box will have an acrylic block in it for you, so then that way you can get right to using your photopolymer stamps. Now I have not opened this box yet, so I will open it up here and we will go through and see what all I got this month for Paper Pumpkin. This does not always come in Paper Pumpkin. This is a reminding us that April is Paper Pumpkin's birthday and our CEO for Stampin' Up! Sarah Douglas is the creator of this of April's Paper Pumpkin. So you if you get your if you subscribe by April 10th and get your code in you will get April's Paper Pumpkin, which is also going to have a free gift. Now, I got a basic gray Stampin' Spot. Every Paper Pumpkin comes with at least one Stampin' Spot. I have gotten one box that has had two. This one has, let me find a piece of paper here that I can put this on. These are the photopolymer stamps that they sent me this month. We have eggs and an Easter or spring theme. Uh, happy spring, happy Easter, I'm glad you're my friend, I think you're great, and stuff to make a bunny. So now it makes me wonder what the rest of the box is. We have, for March 2017, Bunny Buddies. Let me move this box out of the way. So then that way we can see what all is in here. I'm having some issues. And it'll give you the instructions on how to do it. There we have bunny ears stickers it looks to be. Are they stickers? Yep. Uh, all sorts of fun stuff here. And everything is already cut out. Everything is... Um, ready just to stamp and stick your stuff to and we have the adhesives that we need any of the embellishments envelopes and it looks like we have little bunny bags to make so i will probably i will be getting in in on doing this um now as far as if on top of me doing the, what it is calling for or intended to do. Um, I like to go off and do my own little thing. And this I can kind of tell is the painter's palette, but on the back of my instructions here, it gives me a list of the colors that are coordinating. So if I wanted to go off on my own and do something else, I totally could because of the fact that it gives me the coordinating colors. You don't have to stick with what what they what the kit is intending to do. I often go off and do my own thing. Um, the reason why I got started in Paper Pumpkin was is I was new to stamping and I did not have very many stamps. I didn't have very many stampin sp uh, stampin pads. So therefore. I saw Paper Pumpkin as an awesome way to build my collection, and if you could see my collection now, 
Um, I have tons of embellishments that are left over. I have tons of, uh, you know, it gives you plenty to do what, what they intend to and what you want to do extra. So I hope you like this look at Paper Pumpkin. And if you are interested in subscribing, there is a link below. There is also um, a little bit more of my story as to how I wanted to, why I got involved in Paper Pumpkin. Um, links to my store are below, as well as um, links to find me in other places. So, um, I hope you have a wonderful time. If you do join Paper Pumpkin, it is wonderful. I'm, I'm sure you'll love it as well. And until next time, 